of Bloody Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans. Again, this is the super fussy, sane kitty Zeno Asagiri. And today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Super Dragon Ball Heroes Meteor Mission Chapter 7 and 8. But before we get into this week happen live reaction, we are at war with YouTube's algorithm and it is slowly but surely killing my channel. And in order to defeat this algorithmic beast, we need you to please hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored. If you love what we're doing and want to help keep me, my adorable little Bubba Kitty right here, and this operation literally alive and kicking, so we could keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be um, news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our cash up and PayPal. Links are in the description box below. So, um, so last time I covered, uh, Super Dragon Ball Heroes, obviously we're still in Asado's body, and man, Asado underestimated, uh, Goku and Vegeta. Yes, they did, and it was amazing to see, but at the end of the chapter, though, we saw, we saw Gohan up in the pods, similar to, um, in the Majin Buu arc. But anyways, let's get to chapter 7 first. See what's in store for us today. Ooh, a burning will. Fight with the sword of red justice. Yes, yeah, speaking of red, I gotta, I gotta cut my hair and dye it red. Will it be Super Saiyan God red? Maybe. I don't know if it'll be that red. But yeah, I'm good. I gotta dye my hair red and, and cut it really, really bad. I I haven't cut it in like four years. It needs to get cut. But God. Trunks is looking very questionable in the face though. Oh God. This art could look so much better. It really could. Um, Nagiyama, seriously. It, it's killing me smalls. But anyways. Let's get into this. Gohan awakens inside Azato's body. Yeah! Gohan is out of the pod! Did get devoured by Azato, meaning I'm inside his body? Yeah. Piccolo! Wake up, Piccolo! It's no use. Um, it's, sorry. It's no use. Whoa, Azato! How are you here inside your body? Dude, this is Majin Buu. Duh. Did you think I would not be able to interfere inside my body? Um, you should not have been able to escape from my stomach. I wonder if this is due to your latent ability. Stomach? This, this is, I believe, a little bit different than, uh, um, with Majin Buu. Majin Buu, if I remember correctly, it was in his head, um, not his stomach. More than anything, in addition to experiencing that power of yours, I would like to eat you once more. What? Nah, go on, not gonna allow that. Oh, doing that inside your body? Just, what are you? Piccolo! No, he transformed into Piccolo. I see, he transformed into Piccolo. Yeah, you must be hurting with that kind nature of yours, fighting with your dear teacher. You know, the timing of this is interesting because we're seeing this kind of situation happening in uh, the Elusive Samurai. Um, Chokiyuki struggled a little bit with this when he's fighting, you know, an evil Fubuki uh, the first time, and it kind of almost killed him. But now, um, and next week, uh, we're gonna see him, uh, um, now with the clean slate, so to speak. Now that he knows what he needs to do, he's gonna, we're gonna see him, uh, hopefully save, uh, Fubuki. Will he die? I don't know. But you gotta save him this time, hopefully. But go on, Ugh, Nakiyama, the face man. Gohan looking very questionable in the face, per usual. But Piccolo actually looks decent in the face. I don't know what it is. Like, the same faces just, or, you know, the more human faces, they look very questionable, but, like, Piccolo is actually looking decent in the face. Ooh, okay. Hmm. No mercy against your teacher either. You're not Piccolo. If it were him, he would tell me to go all out. This is literally what Aki said to, to uh, um, to Tokiyuki. He said, this is what he said, and I love it. He said, if you don't go all out and, like, surpass 
your master, because that's what your master would want, then you're basically patronizing him. And I'm paraphrasing it, but you know what I mean. But yeah, go on saying this just seriously made me think of Aki. Go read The Elusive Samurai. I've been covering it since chapter one, and I'm hoping, and based on the reaction, I'm glad uh, people are going to have it here. Um, the Elusive Samurai has been the next Demon Slayer, or the new Demon Slayer. It's better than Demon Slayer, in my opinion. And um, leading up to the anime, Demon Slayer was the same thing. People didn't know about it. People were hating them um, in the West, especially. They didn't know about it. Where um, It was uh, very unknown and all that. But as soon as the anime came out, completely different story. It blew up. I'm telling you, go be the same thing with the elusive, uh, um, the elusive samurai. Oh, hands down. Uh, I see. What a wonderful bond between you two. In that case, no, that is mean. That's a low blow using the Dell. Stop it, Gohan. Dell, no. Oh, I found your weakness. No, he ate Fidel. And Pan! He ate Pan? Not eating Videl and Pan! Videl Pan! Um, now show it to me, please. Your true power. Stop! He scratched Pan! Oh! Ooh! This is not Super Saiyan 4, Gohan, we're seeing. A wonderful energy blast, but if you throw your power around like that, you'll end up accidentally hurting the sleepy ones you want to protect the most. Be aware of that linear nature of yours first. Maybe it's a good opportunity to learn uh, to control your key in a subtle way. Hmm. Ooh. Yeah! Excellent. That explosive power of yours for other sakes exceeds that of Goku's, even if for just a moment. Yes, 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 dude. This is this is what we wanted. This is what Gohan fans have been wanting. Let's see. Give the uh, back those two. Oh, it open. Where is this? Oh, hello, Goku. Huh, Gohan? Is that you? How are you in the uh, in the palace? Palace? This is Azoto's. Uh oh. Gohan. Oh, damn it. Oh, he really does have a wonderful latent ability within him. You bastard, Goku! You had to distract him! My power is overflowing! Uh-oh. God damn it, he's here again! No, he's got Bulma! No! Bulma! No! I'm surprised. You two have similar emotions. No shit, they're saved, you fucking idiot! If I hurt her, then I will draw out your latent ability. Should I eat you? Oh, how about this? Oh, no! You bastard, I've had enough of you! Too bad, even though I've angered you, you haven't pushed past your limit. You're low on stamina, too. But the unfathomable power you showed me a while ago is enough. I could savor the flavor that way. Oh, not Elder Kai! Dude, he ate El Oh, he ate the Elder Kai. Oh, no. Kakarot! Ah, oh, the Patara! Elder Kai's Patara! You good with this, Vegeta? Yeah, let's go! Yeah, the strongest fusion warrior Vegito appears. Let's go crazy. Or, sorry, let's get crazy. Yeah, fan service! Fan service! Dude, this manga is like pure guilty pleasure. God damn it! They, the motherfucker ate Videl, Pan, and Bola, but no bra? Interesting. Or trunks either. Hmm. Very interesting. Anyways, let's keep going here. He's launching an assault on the God Eater. The gods are passing Vegito. But you know what? That's another thing that's very interesting too. Because we've seen, I know this is mainly in the anime that's been seen, where Pan has uh had latent abilities too so hmm very interesting nagiyama i see you 
All right, let's go, Vegito. Yeah! Oh, God, the face is killing me! I got I'm trying to get past it. But, God. Dude. I love this manga so much. Like, I just... Here's the thing. I have to say this. The people that are like, oh, we need Dragon Ball. Motherfucker, just, like, anyone that is bitching, anyone in the Dragon Ball fandom that is bitching about the lack of Dragon Ball content, just tell them, go read Super Dragon Ball Heroes, and they will be happy. They It has the fan, even though the art is not a... I'm sorry, Nagayama. You know it is... Uh, no, you know it is true. Sorry, Nagayama. It, it, it is what it is. I know art is subjective, but my god. Nagayama, please. The faces. It's just the faces are killing me, man. They're very questionable, and, um, and the fighting is stiff. In terms of combat art. It, it gets very, very stiff. It, it does. But, man, like... Just tell, just tell these mofos to read the Super Dragon Ball Heroes manga. It's just so good. And, God, it gives them the fan service they want. The anime may be questionable. The anime is probably just as questionable in terms of, like, art and animation. Maybe even more questionable. I don't know. But, ugh. I love this manga so much. I think the manga, I think the manga has better writing than, uh, than the anime. But, God... Vegeta looks better here on page five. I'll tell you that. Ooh. Oh, okay. Now this is looking better. The combat art is... I'll say this, though. Nagiyama, when your combat art is on, it is on. It, it, it is working. It's looking a lot better. 10, 20, 30... Uh, 10, 20... 30 bodies, some Gohan's power that pushes your latent ability to its up, um, utmost limit. This might be a power that surpasses a god, too. Um, you just keep on changing, don't you? Like, yeah, he's in Super Saiyan Blue. No shit. It's, it's more powerful than, it's a it's Super Saiyan God. Like, or it's a god. It's Super Saiyan Blue. Yeah, he has the power of a god, dumbass. Of course it is. Ooh. Uh oh. Ooh, it's not looking good. He's hard, just like that demigrad. Oh god, that's so much phrasing. He's hard, just like that demigrad guy, dude. Demigrad is still, in terms of villains, God. Imagine if demigrad was in the main Dragon Ball Super manga. Oh my god, I need that in my life. I do. I I, I know. I know it's prob it's wrong, probably wrong for me to want it. But god damn it, I need it. At least I have him here. Then how about this? Yo! This is nice. I wish there was on page eleven the spread. I wish there was just a little bit of shading like on this side on uh um on the profile for Vegito's profile. Just a little bit of shading would have made this so much better. But god, this looks good. Damn, that's hard. Even my spirit sword's useless, huh? Ooh. The profiles are looking... I don't know. The profile's looking a little bit better. Maybe that's what it... Mm, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Nakiyama's profile art looks okay. But man. The combat art is looking a little stiff still, but... Hmm. You know what? I'm going to say this in terms of the combat art here. Considering they're in Ozato's body. If you want to make the argument that there's... Gr um, that... Uh, oh, that it's heavier up in there. Then I can may maybe give it a pass. For it being a little stiffer. But when you're using energy like that... No. No reason for it to be this stiff. Ooh, now this is nice at the bottom of page 13. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, as expected of the fusion wire. To th no, not Krillin! To 
thank you that you haven't hurt a single devoured one with your big moves. I'm impressed. I can counter you with my own big moves too, but... Foo foo foo, how about I bring out a, a whole bunch of casualties for you? Hang on, is this guy serious? Um, let's see. Ignite vision! Whoa, what? Whoa, okay, Nagayama, I see you. Page 17 is looking nice. I like this. The form, oh, the formation, oh god, this is nice. This is nice. The formation of uh, the victims, oh, or, you know, the casualties, Azada's casualties. This is really nice. I think it, it could be executed a little bit better if it was just a little bit, um, I say if it's a little bit darker in some areas, yeah, probably. Or maybe even a little bit more of the, uh, um, oh, what's the wording I'm looking for? Part of me wants to say plasma. That's probably the wrong wording for it. But I wish there was just a little bit more of it just going around. Um, in here to, like, really give that, like, I went to make it a little bit more, um, fluid. But other than that, it looks nice. That was close. This asshole's using his technique around everyone. Uh-oh. Kian, uh, oh, no, we got him. Bon appetit to the fusion power. Hell not. <laughs> Too bad for you I have this barrier. Well, yeah, that bit, for those of you that don't remember, this was the barrier that um, Vegito used uh, in uh, the Majin Buu arc when he got absorbed by, um, I think it was by uh, Buhan, right? Yeah, it was by Buhan. Yeah. I remember. Yeah, yeah. I love he stuck his tongue too, yeah. <laughs> Allow me to show you then the power of a god that you wish to surpass. Ooh, the King Kai Fist! Yeah! Oh! Page 21 has got to be one of the best panels in this manga right now. I need this colored. Page 21 of chapter se uh, chapter 8, this needs to be colored. Oh my god, why is this not colored? This is beautiful. This is definitely one of the best, best pages, well, spreads, I should say, that Nagiyama has done. Oh my god, this is beautiful. At least in, well, so far in this, um, in this part, I would say. This is beautiful. Oh my god, can we get more of this, especially in terms of line work? Oh, and the face is nice, the eyes look good. I need more of this line work and this shading. Please, Nagiyama, give me more of this. This is what I need in my life in terms of art. Oh my god, this is everything. More, more of this. More of this! Ooh. Ooh, page 23 is looking good too. You know what? Uh, I was gonna say page 22, but then the, the face. Page 23 actually, page 23 looks good though. Page 23 looks nice. Oh, the face, the face in the middle panel on page 24. That looks good. I'm happy. And then we got the diffusion, of course, of Goku and Vegeta. Um, of Vegito. Can you stand Gohan? Yeah, I'm okay. Thank you for saving me. But why are you and Vegeta inside Ozawa's body? Did you say Ozawa's body? Oh, my oh my, I've been quite greedy. We did so many clones that um, they've even gone as far as eating some Gohan. Oh, no matter how many I throw against the god and produced fusion, uh, fusion warrior, in the end they're all just clones. I couldn't hope to win after all. Really now, having all that power go, um, go over my head is just like me. Such a bad habit. However, they were able to buy me enough time and now I finally obtained it. 
No! The power to govern over time! No! No! Osada's absorbed the power of the Supreme Kai of Time. Can Goku and the others hope to win? He got the Supreme Kai of Time? Oh, they are fucked! Oh, they are so fucked! They got the Supreme Kai of Time? Oh no, they are so fucked! Oh, they are so fucked! They are fucked, but man, I really love what we're getting with Meteor Mission. I really, really do. Um, I like the Gohan's latent power came out. I really, um, I, uh, like that he was able to control his key. Now, I gotta compare this to Kagurabachi for a second because we did have something similar going on um, with the, uh, um, uh, oh my god, what is his name? It's Akuri, there we go. We had something similar going on with Akuri with his latent power. I'm spoiling a deal with it. But the thing is, the difference between, like, Hakuri and Gohan here is, like, is Gohan, I can understand him being able to control his latent power because, because you know, he's trained for a long period of time. And Akuri, and, and um, also not just that, Gohan's power, like, actually, this is a good comparison. I should have done that in my Kagurabachi video. Maybe I'll do that next week. Note to self, we are going to compare Hakuri to Gohan. Oh my god, I might have to do a video on that. But, oh god. But it's just, I'm just so frustrated with Kagurabachi with how, um, because we have something similar going on with, as I said, with Hakuri. And I don't, I really don't like how it's being executed. Like, with how Toriyama executed Gohan, Gohan is, was the right way to do it. Um, in terms of latent power, but not, just not tortured like, uh, um, like Curry was. But anyways, enough of that. Um, in terms of, uh, um, in terms of how Gohan handled his power, because he's been training for a long time, and even though, even though he's trained for a long period of time, he had, he had to re, like, um, get back in touch with his key once more and control his key again. But for Gohan, it's like, it's like riding a bike kind of thing in terms of key. Like once you know how to do it, even if you haven't done it for a long period of time, you should be able to pick it, pick, um, pick it right up again. Yeah, it may be weaker, sure, but you can still do it. But man, I really do like Azado. I like I really like the Majin Buu esqueness of Azado. I really like that we're get. I really like how much he, he is like Moro and Majin Buu and Cell. I like that he is like every Dragon Ball villain we've seen, like Z specifically and Super combined. It just works. It really does. Because I know people, I know there's going to be people that are like, that are all pissy about it, but the way Azato's written just really is doing it for me. I really like it. But man, I just have to wonder at some point, like, if he, I have to wonder though, if he's got the supreme Kai of time here, there's got to be a point where Whis and, uh, um, and Beerus intervene. Whis has got, or at least um, Beerus has to intervene because you he's already absorbed the Elder Kai, right? Now you got the Supreme Kai of Time be, um, absorbed. But if remember, if he gets, um, if he gets Shin, you know, if he gets Shin, then Beerus dies too. He disappears because their lives are connected. So Beerus got to show up at some point. N maybe not even just Beerus. Um, you have to wonder if um, if some of the other uh, Supreme, or not Supreme God, the other um, Gods of Destruction are going to show up here as well. So remember, Gods of Destruction's lives are connected to the Supreme Kai's. 
there's got to be a point where they show up. They got to show If we get this, if we get this, where you have the gods of destruction showing up and fighting Azato, oh my god, this manga will be even more amazing. Please. Please, Nagayama. Please give me this. Where we get to see the gods of destruction fight this motherfucker. There's no reason for this not to happen. Especially when he is absorbing Supreme Kai's. You have there You got this has gotta happen at some point. Beerus has to intervene. There's no reason to not have the gods of destruction intervene at this point. They have to. Normally I'd be like, yeah, whatever, but if you have the Supreme Kai of Time here, Beerus has to intervene. And the great and you know, again, you um I have to one the other thing I have to wonder though, is the where what about um What about the Grand Priest? Are we going to see him get involved? Well, the Grand Priest, I don't think, will get involved directly. But I feel like he will um, put the order out for the angels to get involved. Because they're Supreme, or because um, the Supreme Kais are being hit, and that means their God of Destructions are going to be affected. I feel like that's going to be the case. But will the... the but will the demon gods get involved too? Because he said he's going after the gods. So demon gods are going to definitely get involved as well. They got to. There's no reason for them to not get involved too. Asado versus the universe will be so... Oh, God. God, I really... There's so much potential with... Th this is why I like Asado so much. There's so much potential here. Especially with fan service. But the question is, will Nagiyama go this route? Will we get to see the gods of destruction here? Will we see um will we see the angels get um involved directly? Especially since we've seen um we now know that the old Kai is there and the Supreme Kai of Time is there. There's no reason for them not to get involved now. I feel like we'll see them, we gotta see them in the next, like, we gotta see them at least meet soon. We gotta see them, like, in a conference, or we gotta, we have to see them. I just can't imagine them not being there. It makes no sense. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. Do you guys think, um, think that, um... The gods of destruction are going to be um, uh, interve um, intervening with this soon, uh, and not I'm not just talking about Beerus. I'm talking about the other gods of destruction because I don't think I now that he has the supreme uh, um, Kai of time, he can go to different time periods. He could probably go to other uni He's probably going to go to other universes too. There's they he has they have to intervene they have to there is no reason for them not to intervene they should have started intervening a while ago but i have to wonder if um maybe like by we're at chapter eight so maybe like within the next couple of chapters we're gonna see them meet up i wonder and the other thing too i think if tola and mira are still alive we're probably remember because they could travel too um, throughout time as well. I wonder if we're going to see an alliance with, um, with them, as w with the demon gods, to take down uh, Azato. That will be very interesting if we see an alliance um, with the, um, if we see the demon gods working with the gods of destruction and, um, and, uh, uh, and the angels. Oh, you see what I mean by there being so much potential here? Oh, God. I oh Seriously, Nagayama, there's so much you could do. Please. Please do that. Please. Please utilize 
the gods of destruction, the angels, the demon gods. Like, especially since you have the supreme, he, Azato has the supreme kind of time. You got, there's no, and also he has the, the elder Kai. You have, there's no way that you don't have this divine intervention. You got it at this point. But anyways, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. Love what we're doing. I want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more um, Dragon Ball content. A few ways you could do that. Donate to our Cash App, PayPal, Patreon. Purchase something off our Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure um, you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.